Hey teachers, at the beginning of every writing lesson, I write this to my students. Being a good writer is 3% talent and 97% not being distracted in class. My quote motivates some and definitely disappoint others, but I bet you won't be disappointed by these writing activities. Let's go. Activities today are all about social media, but in 3D. Most of our students, especially mine, are obsessed with Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. So why not using these networks in class, but with pencils and pens? Let's just start with Twitter. Twitter is the perfect place to teach everything writing related. I gave the students a topic, let's say food. I noticed that I always go with food so i'm sorry i give each student a copy of a tweet template like this one by the way you can absolutely download it link is in the description i was teaching compound sentences and i told them to write a tweet using this type of sentence structure about food please don't forget to encourage them to use hashtags after they finished tweeting we read some tweets and checked their structure then we moved on to another Another topic, for instance, K-pop. And for this topic, I ask them to use a complex sentence. What I like about this activity is I can mostly apply it with any writing lesson, not only the four types of sentence structures. Another variation of using a Twitter is I provide them with a tweet of a famous person. Let's go with Elon Musk because my students were like diehard fans. I don't know, for some reason, they thought being a crazy fan of them will make them rich but that's a different story anyway choose a person that your students is familiar with preferably someone who's local and funny or go with shakespeare everybody knows him and let him tweet something weird and crazy but for this video let's go back to mr musk so i showed the students this tweet of him that i totally made up and i told them to reply to him using the second conditional only again you can specify in structure you want want. Time to check Instagram. Since it's all about the picture, let's use pictures. One activity is to provide every two students or a group, if you have a large class, with an Instagram post that is missing the caption and they have to work together and write one. Instagram is fun for paragraphs because unlike Twitter, students can go on and on with no character limitation. So maybe write a caption that is a descriptive paragraph or a narrative paragraph or anything related to what you're actually teaching. You can give all the students the same picture and let them compare their writings when they're done, but I personally prefer picking different pictures so students won't get bored at the end. The second activity is kind of similar to the second one of a Twitter. Show them a picture that a famous celebrity posted and they have to comment in their post, whether freely or using a certain expression or structure. Our last Instagram activity is with none other than Insta Stories. For this one, I went with the Ask Me a Question sticker. If you have specific questions you want your precious students to answer, then write them yourself on these templates that you can also download. Link is in the description. And ask every student to pick one and write their answers on it. Or, and that's what I actually did with my group, I let the students write write the questions themselves and then I collected them and randomly asked each student to pick a question and write their answer on it. At the end, we read the answers and we went over some writing tips and techniques when it was necessary. That's pretty it. Thank you teachers for being in my channel.